Mary J. Blige is a Grammy-winning, <laughs> Emmy-winning, Oscar-nominated singer, actress, and entrepreneur. But above all else, she is a music icon. Just, you just hear her music and you feel instantly better. She is bringing her third annual Strength of a Woman Festival and Summit right here to her hometown of New York City. We're excited to have Mary with us, and we're going to talk about that in just a bit. First of all, there are so many accolades coming your way. We're so proud of you. The Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. We've been waiting for yes. that. What, is, what does that feel like to get an award that you are, that you haven't ever gotten before? Well, it's not even an award. I'm nominated. Yeah. But yeah. It, is, it is an award. Yeah. But, I mean, because of the um, company that I'm in, I mean, I'm, I'm nominated with... Um, Lenny Kravitz, yes. Cher, yeah. um, Sade, yes. Mariah Carey, Journey, Tribe, Talk, Tribe Called Quest, Run DMC. I mean, I mean, all these iconic people, you know, and, and me. <laughs> well, we can't wait. Does it, what does it feel like? Because we know your journey mm -hmm. and we know what it took for you to get here and the things you had to overcome and the insecurities and life. But when you reach a moment like mm -hmm. this one, I mean, what do you look back at how far you've come along this journey? Absolutely. I mean, it's, it's humbling. And this, these moments keep me looking back like, wow, Mary, you've come a long way. Yeah. I mean, the company that you're in, in this category, is massive. Like, it's like, you know, <laughs> Cher. I mean, you know, <laughs> Cher, I mean, you know, Sade, you know. So, um, yeah, it's, it's humbling. I mean, stuff like this, it doesn't make me into an idiot or, you know, <laughs> a cocky, you know, jerk. It just really pulls me, to, um, puts me in front of where I've been, you know, and, yeah. and how far, you know, I've come. Yeah. Um, we also love this because you just received the Entertainment Icon Award mm -hmm. at the Urban One Honors. Yes. And you said something that really touched mm -hmm. both of us. When you accepted your award, you said, I want to do something I've never done. I want to thank myself. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Talk about wh why. Mm -hmm. what, what is that? What was that? Because I, I never, I never thought that I could. I never thought I was supposed to. Mm -hmm. But after I've been through so, 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 so much and come through so much, you know, gracefully. Yeah. I, I'm, yes, I, I owe myself a, a thank you. And that's why I said I want to do something I've never done before because I never thought that I could, you know, we, yeah. we, we, we grew up thinking we couldn't boast or brag yes. or, mm -hmm. you know, love on ourselves. And now I'm doing all that. I'm boasting, I'm bragging, I'm <laughs> loving on myself because I've earned it. So you're doing that publicly, but do you find that the way you've even talked to yourself is different than maybe 20, 30 years it, ago? It really is. Yeah. I mean, I have so much fun with myself. I'm like, girl, you look so good. <laughs> oh, I'm so proud of you. Oh, that looks nice on you. And I'm always, I'm by myself a lot. So I'm always like, oh, Mary, I love that. Oh, Let's wear this tomorrow. Well, that's going to be hot. Well, you know? Yeah, my friend, you know? So, yeah, I, and I love me. You know what? Absolutely. That's such a huge step. It because really a, a lot of people, I feel like, need to get an added girl from someone outside to feel good about themselves. So what, what was it that flipped that made you say, you know what? As long as I'm good with me, that's all that really matters in this moment. I mean, I was just getting frustrated with having to, you know, be what everybody wanted me to be and yeah. it was it was uncomfortable and, and, and the, I was like is this the one thing that's making me uncomfortable well then excuse me the hell with everybody yeah. else yeah. it's about me and what I love and I, I believe that what I believe about me and, and think about me and believe about me is more important than anybody and, you, and more effective than anybody so believes true. what do you believe about yourself I believe that I'm a I, I'm, I'm not perfect but I'm a good person I always strive to do the right thing. Mm -hmm. um, I have a lot of integrity. I try to keep my word. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. I'm, I'm a great daughter. I'm a great friend. I'm a great, you know, I'm, I'm there. I'm, I'm reliable. Mm -hmm. You know, um, I, I keep my word. That's why I say I'm, I'm, I'm a woman of integrity. Mm -hmm. And I'm not perfect, but I strive to be better. Yes. Mm -hmm. and, and that's what I love about me. I love the fact that I want to do the right thing. Even when it's hard, I want to do the hard thing, even if it's because you, you, it's the right thing. Yes. Mm -hmm. You know, that is, I mean, it's, I feel like it's such a game changer. We have to talk about the fact that your debut album just turned 30. Oh, yeah. My, my life, life. We couldn't. We had to be my Google. life. That one. Well, that's, the, that's the second one. Oh, okay. Yeah. Your second album. One, one your second today. album. Yeah, yeah, You're yeah. right. This so, is, but my yeah. life was that. My life yeah, was yeah. like the album. Yeah. So I guess it was my <laughs> yeah. obsession. Yeah. All of our obsessions. Yeah. We Googled it because we were like, it can't be 30 years yeah. old. Yes. Yeah, but you wrote about such 
important mm -hmm. and also hard mm -hmm. things yeah. in that album. When you look back to that mm -hmm. time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, the My Life album was me just basically really crying for help and just wanting somebody to love me. Mm -hmm. Oh, please don't go. Oh, I'll never want to live without you. And these are the t <laughs> songs that are t titled, the title of the songs, yeah. which I absolutely love. And they were just a, a point in my life where I just was looking for love in all the wrong places. Ooh. But at the same time, I wrote a song called My Life that you know, relates to me right now yeah. today and scares the mess out of me. And I'm like, how did I do that? <laughs> how did she you know? do that? Because life can know? be only what you make it and look at what, you know, well, look how I'm making it. I love that the number one single that you have right now is called Still Believe in what? Love. It's been yeah. number one on the R&B charts for the last eight weeks. Yeah. So our question is, do you still believe in love? Absolutely. I mean, that's the only way I'm able to have, be, be my own company. I, I believe in love for myself. I believe I'm not going to, um, because I believe in love for myself, I'm not going to give up on love. Yes. I'm not going to let a bad relationship or a bad marriage stop me from, you know, having a, a, a good life and having mm -hmm. romance and having, getting the hugs that I want and mm -hmm. desire and mm -hmm. kiss, kisses. And, uh, you know, I, I'm not going to say I'm so hard. And I, no, I want a man. I want love. I want it all. And, 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 I, and, and I'm not going to let my past stopped me from that and I believe it's because I love myself yes. like that I'm mm -hmm. able to draw things to me mm -hmm. and I'm able to receive the love that I know I deserve mm -hmm. it's so that's so smart okay well that. so are you dating yep <laughs> <laughs> We that's got it. it. Yep. That's, that's it. it. That's, that's it. it. Well, Let's leave it at yep. Okay. Well, you've got so many other things you're working on. Your own, you've got your own music label. You've got this festival coming mm -hmm. up. We're going to take a break, and then we're going to come back and talk about all okay. of the strength yeah. of a woman okay. festival coming up. Right yeah, after yeah, this. <laughs> yes. I love thank it you. so much. We are back with the one and mm. only Mary J. Blige. Don't you love when your own music comes on? Do you ever just want to <laughs> sing out? When you I do when now. You, I didn't you, used to. You didn't used to? Yeah. I didn't like the sound of my voice, but now I've listened to my music. Now I love everything about me. I do. Wow, I can't it believe there was ever a change. time where you I didn't. Know. Oh, I, hate, I used to hate everything about me, the sound of my voice, the sound of my speaking voice. And I used to just be afraid to hear any music back. But now I listen to the My Life album. I listen to all my albums like I'm, I'm a fan. <laughs> Fan. And we're a fan, too. Yeah. And Thank one of the you. things that we always admire so much about you is that you want to take all of your goodness and pass it on. You mm -hmm. don't just yeah. keep it for yourself. So you've started this incredible Strength of a Woman mm -hmm. festival. Mm -hmm. Third year. Yes. Mm -hmm. It happens soon over Mother's Day. Why did you want to create this? Mm -hmm. Well, because... Um, when I in my concerts, I look out in the audience, and the women are always just holding on to my every word. They're mm -hmm. celebrating me. They're crying. Yeah. And I said, you know, what what can I do for them? You know, and to celebrate them on Mother's Day weekend mm. with the title of the festival called "The Strength of a Woman." Mm -hmm. I mean, every strong woman is out there representing Mary J. Blige and mm -hmm. loving Mary J. Blige and loving what I stand for. And so this is all for them. You know, education. Uh. uh elevation and empowerment of women so and and then of course entertainment and just us loving on each other and, and I, I just wanted to love on us you know and and celebrate us during mother's day who was the woman who was your strength when you were like going through your really rough times my mom yeah my mom because she was very strong when I was growing up and she went through hell. She's a single parent mom. Yeah. And we had the environment we lived in was just horrible. But she raised two amazing, you know, women because it was just me and my sister at first and now I have a little brother and little sister. Mm -hmm. And she did it by herself. And um she I've never really seen her cry. I always seen her take care of her skin, take care of her, her body, mm -hmm. go, you know, go to work, you know, just continue to stay up in such a terrible environment mm -hmm. and so she's she's been my strength my mom mm. yeah. back to your festival for a second so if women want to go to this thing yeah. is it open like can anyone go and it's in new york yeah right? the tickets are on sale right now um pre for pre-sale okay and generals are, are sale tickets start on um friday mm -hmm. but right now i mean yeah, come on, come That's one, right. come all, everybody, let's go. This I is, like it. I like and, it. And we're what's bringing it home. Cool is you're taking it. You're, it's all around New York. You're going yeah. to all of the coolest it's, places. It's it's everywhere. It's in Brooklyn. It's in Manhattan. It's it's the yeah, Apollo. It, it's at the, so we have the Apollo. We have the Barclays. So we have the wow. the comedy night oh, cool. with Tiffany Haddish and a very very special surprise. Yeah, okay. Com comedy guest, and we have um, the Barclay. Uh, the the the, the 
concert night where um, it's me, 50 Cent, Mooney Long, um, mm -hmm. Jill Scott, mm -hmm. Jada Kiss, Fat Joe, Amazing. Um, wow. Lola Brooke, and, and some more surprise special ooh. guests. It's going to be ooh. it's going to be a lit time. And we have to talk about your music time. label. We're too. dying to talk about this music label. You just okay, okay. Oh, I'm sorry. I got to mention the Clarks. So we have a yes. gospel brunch on Sunday. Where's and the gospel I, brunch? It's at uh, the. Well done, Pooh. Here we go. Brooklyn Chop House. Yes. yes. <laughs> so shout out, Brooklyn. And, and, um, and uh, the mm -hmm. Clark Sisters are performing in Br Brooklyn at night as wow. well. So, God, wow. It's really yeah. an amazing okay, weekend. Okay, so this music label. Tell us about what made you want to start it. Well, um, I never wanted to start a music label. I mean, I, I tried a couple of times, but I never really wanted to do it because... I needed to have the finances to make people's dreams come true. Yeah. You know, I'm not saying I'm spending, you know, breaking the bank on everybody, but I, I needed to make sure I can take care of everybody. And I found some talent. These these guys, Juan Moore, my, my, my little boys, my babies. <sighs> these are all Juan Moore's children, Juan Ye's children. Oh, wow. From boys to men. Yes. And I mean, and discovering them it was like discovering a jewel. So... Um, I mean, I was like, I got to start a label with these guys, man. Wow. And, um, I mean, they can sing, I mean, incredibly. And my artist, Vado, who's on Still Believe with me, mm -hmm. um, the, um, the rapper, um, he's just amazing. Um, amazing. I, I heard an album of his because he's had music out before. And um, I was like, wow, this, you know, one of my girlfriends um, introduced me to, to the album. Um, and I was like, wow, okay, I, this guy's dope. I need him on Still Believe. Yeah. And he was on Still Believe. And I was like, whoa, okay, <laughs> let's, really, let's really get this going. And so the rest is history and beautiful life history. Wow. That's What's so later. cool is you're starting it around young talent. Yeah. You're I mentoring people, which is yeah. amazing. What you do. Yeah. Mary, we love you. Thank we you. We love, love you. Thank you. you. Thank you. So this for weekend you. sounds amazing, y'all. Do not miss it. Mary's Strength of a Woman Festival and Summit. It begins May 10th. Can tickets I, are on sale now. Go. Yes, yeah. tickets are on sale yeah. now. I want to give a big shout out to my partners, Pepsi uh -huh. and um, uh -huh. um, Live Nation. Yes. Oh, yeah. Thank you so much for, I mean, they've been with me from day one of this. Yes. I love of you guys. Of I'll course. see y'all tomorrow. That's I'll see y'all tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> but you guys, they're on sale now, but you can also, they go on general sale this Friday, too.